Hello everyone and welcome back to Mega Man Battle Network 3 white version bug style only on the Mega Man Battle Network Legacy Collection. My name is Moose. My chair just kind of like backed up on me there. That was kind of weird. But hi. How y'all doing? It's wonderful to see you again. In the last episode, we made a way to come visit Yaya. She landed on her big old melon. Uh, and of course, as usual, we were asked to go do something for her because, you know, our friend's not doing too well. But if you guys haven't already, make sure you guys do check out the description down below. Uh, down below is linked to playlist where you guys can go back and watch from episode one. If you just click play, it should all be in order. I'll double check it just in case, but it should all be in order. Uh, we gotta go to floor one. And also down below are some cool Mega Man Battle Network themed wallpapers. If you're interested and want to go view them, download them, have some fun. All that good jazz. So you guys might notice my webcam is just a smidge lower now. Uh, I had a couple comments asking if I could move it to go underneath the health bar. And initially I was like, oh, I won't be too bad, the whole health bar thing. And then I realized there's a whole HP bug thing where I was like, I should probably see it like have it up so now you guys can see the health bar a little bit better so i appreciate the feedback and all the kind words that everyone's been bringing so yeah now we're just kind of chilling just kind of gonna do some virus busting honestly for a little bit here just kind of wanted to stretch stretch ye old legs um huge excellent so yeah, so we're gonna grab some tea for Yai. And we're quickly gonna bust some viruses. I just want to see everything look pretty good. So, so pretty. Uh, it's a little. It's like, it's like. Do I want to just a little bit? Maybe I'll just, just, just a little. Just so the pets in frame. There you go. Just, just so now everything's all flush. Just so all the OCD homies don't lose it. There we go. So we're gonna go pick up a tea after we decided to blow up. So there's a lot of viruses in this world. So now we get introduced to a new character, uh, and I'm gonna be honest, I'm terrible at pronouncing their name. Uh, Marmu, Marmo, Ma, 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 Mamaru, Mamaru. I'm bad at names. Sorry. So this is kind of like an interesting part of the game because some people really don't like it, uh, or some people, I guess, don't not say that. A lot of casual, you would kind of struggle with it a little bit because this upcoming part, uh, especially me as a kid. I was dumb and didn't really talk to a lot of people. So I'm gonna kind of give like a synopsis of what's going on. So this is homie. He is in a wheelchair. Mar 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 I can't do it. My, my dyslexia doesn't let me do it. So he's a big fan of us because we're a net battler and he wants to be a net battler like us too. So he's getting really excited. Um, so he has a condition which I will cover later on in a little bit. Kind of just like as the text is going through here. But pretty much in the upcoming scenario, we need to get a chip called Ice Ball M. Ice Ball M is a chip that can really that can only appear if you have the fish data installed into your um, uh, Navi customizer, and then you have to go into Hades Island and try to find it somewhere in there and delete these, like, cold heads. It doesn't sound hard when I tell you that, but the way you find that out is a lot different. You have to do, like, a lot of investigating, a lot of looking around the beach areas, and there's very scarce amount of clues. Um, so yeah. Um, if you guys are struggling with this part, the fishy program is bought in the beach area square with the Navi program, so make sure you have enough Zenny for it. And the ice balls are found in Hades Isle, which I think they're, I don't remember if they're in a secluded area. But I'm pretty much gonna go quickly run and go get those. We wanna go to the first floor. Okay, so now we're kind of free. We get to go back home, but I need to go pick up that program. So, if we can, let's go ahead and knock it out now. How much money do I have? I think I should have enough for Fishy. I don't remember the exact price of it, but we're going to break into Mail's house. We're going to go on up here, and because she has a 
She has a teleport to Yoka, which Yoka is very good because it's right beside the station. So we don't, the only real area we need to virus bust is in here. I'm getting a text message from my mom. It was my mom's birthday yesterday. Well, 25th. I don't know when these are coming out. So they kind of, actually, no, this should be out tomorrow. Yeah, so the 25th. So it wasn't too long ago. It's easy to keep track. I swear I'm not overthinking this. Um, so we're going to head straight to beach area. Yoko's a nice little cut through. And then we are going to get this fishy program. I'm pretty sure you get fishy from beach area. I'm either about to look really dumb or really smart. So, yeah. And we're going to run up here. I still cannot wait to get all the side missions done because traveling the beach area gets a lot better once that happens. It goes a lot faster. Just trims so much of the fat off. Very nice. Um, crap. I don't have much here, really, eh? No problem. Ooh! I finally get to do this combo. I've been waiting for this one. Wait, I didn't grab snakes. It's okay. All right, boys, are we ready for maximum overkill? Because I know I am. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Totally unnecessary. <laughs> Hopefully, we really get to flush out the deck in a better way. I know I've gotten a lot of feedback, people saying that white version is not best. And I know. I'm feeling it. Don't worry. Um, but I, I will make this work. I, it just adds more to the challenge. What... They didn't add a hard mode into this game, so why not make your own hard mode? You know what I'm saying? It's a genius idea. Snakes on a plane, baby. Look at these chip combos. Huge chippies. Ah, oh, we don't know. We just have health deplete. How gross. Uh... You out. Bubble air. Very nice. What are we at? Okay. Fanfare Y. Interesting. Okay. So we've got an interesting assortment of Y chips. I'm going to go grab this because my brain is telling me to. Rock Cube. Can't wait to not use that. We have a really interesting assortment of Y chips so far. Um, Probably some of the most scattered I've seen. I am, like I said, I am learning... You guys are watching me learn right now, so don't. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I have a question for you guys. Since white version is like the inferior version of the three series, what's better for four? Is it blue or is it, is it red sun or blue moon? Which one's the better version? Because I want to do a new game. So I actually was... I've, I've opened up all the games mostly. Except for like 1, 2, and 6 so far in the Battle Network collection. Um, I know that the patch cards in 4 are actually really interesting. Uh, they offer some of the most creative playthroughs we can do. There's a lot of bugs involved in everything else. So I wish there's a way I could run a poll. Like I don't know if I have that access yet on the YouTube channel. Um... But, oh god, come here. I would like to run a poll to kind of be interested to see what people, oh, I get to try, no, hold on. I want to try, I want to try this. Okay, so how does geyser work? Do I have to do it on my panels? Okay, so it just, as long as I use it on a hole, it goes forward, cool. Duly noted. I have learned. Um, but I'd really like to try... I would like a way to find a pull. But I've learned that in Mega Man Battle Network 4, there's patch cards that allow you to use the double souls, like, pretty much for your whole playthrough. So I kind of wanted to do a proto-soul only run. I thought that would be really interesting. Uh, I just kind of depends on what everyone else would think. Like, what would be more intriguing? A new game plus only run? 
or like doing it with only one soul available to you and just kind of trying to play around that because i know the final boss is kind of a pain and it's not really sword friendly for like a proto soul or something like that but i mean i just want to do this for fun so I, I didn't realize how much they added in or like what patch cards really were until right now so uh, i don't want to actually buy the hp memory up i, I almost just completely screwed myself uh you oh i accidentally just logged in the simon says okay so let's see how bad i can do ready boys here we go ha 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 wrong one ha ha wrong one ha what am i doing ha 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 who he yeah oh yeah yeah ha that's b dang it yeah yeah uh-huh yeah 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 uh-huh 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 yeah oh yeah we're, we're schmoovin we're schmoovin i'm dumb uh I'm K. Why my lefts and rights so scuffed today? I didn't mean to do this in all honesty. B left B A B. Why my lefts and rights so bad today? Left down R B left left down left B. That's A. I'm so bad at this. I'm sorry. I didn't, I didn't mean to, I wasn't prepared. That's on me. I was close to, you keep away from me. You just give me a buck for eggs. Uh, fish, here we go, 8,000, perfect. So now we have fish that we're gonna jack out. We're gonna go over here and we are going to get our virus data. So we're gonna install fish, sort of. Uh, remove, 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 fish, here, install, uh, move, move, here, HP, here, remove, move, here, um, sure, here, whatever, go. Oh, I'm dumb. I just put a purple here. That's not what I meant to do. Uh, okay, nothing goes here then. Cool. A der. All right, so now that we've got fish installed, uh, what we can do... I know it really doesn't matter if I actually put bugs in the Navi cuss. I just don't want to do an excessive amount. I don't know. Brain be funny right now. So we're going to go over here, we're going to head over to Hades Isle, and we're going to try to obtain the Ice Ball M chip, which is probably the most annoying part. And I really hope it doesn't change in Mega Man Battle Network White, because I fall to my knees. Um, so we're just going to try to go get it anyway. So we're going to jack in here. We have the fish. So what fish data does um, in the Navi Cus is it allows people, or allows viruses, not people, uh, it forces certain element spawns um so what we can do here is there's like oil there's battery there's tree i think and then there's fish which all contain to there's a lot of viruses here what the heck um which all allow like the elements that will kind of correlate to that to spawn in so you could get like uh, oils like for fire and then batteries for electric. So I was thinking because we had aqua cuss, when I get oil, I might just keep it in. Not aqua cuss, aqua bug. Um, I might just keep in oil so that more fire viruses spawn in. And that could also give me some pretty decent battle chip. So pretty much I just need to hope they sp it's in, right? Like I don't... Okay, fish is in. So now, here's the fun part. We kind of just spin and hope they spawn in. No, we got shrimpies. Everything sucks. Snakes. Snakes. 
That's some pretty pristine virus busting, if I do say so myself. Huge. All right, perfect. So take that out. We're just going to get some zenning. Pretty much, this is kind of like one of the more tedious parts of the playthrough. <coughs> is me not dying on camera? Where did that come from? He's got the COVID. He has the COVID-19. No, I'm fine. Oh, God. So this next upcoming area um, or scenario probably is my second least favorite besides Bubble. Like, Bubble Man is tedious, annoying. This, these next few ones are more, how do I put it? They're, I already have enough inventory to not make them a pain in the butt, but if you're not prepared for it, it could probably take you much longer than you'd anticipate. So, uh, we do have a good amount of fire chips, by the way. Also, if you're getting ready for this next scenario, no spoilers, but do get yourselves a good chunk of fire chips. It, you will thank yourself later, pretty much. Um, it makes it a lot more enjoyable. It, it just, it makes the whole everything just kind of better. So, pretty much still waiting for the special cool head enemies to spawn in. I'm pretty sure we still have to get Ice Ball M. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, I should probably look it up in all honesty, but this is, I'm, I don't think it, I'm pretty sure I remember Ice Ball M as a kid too. And we're going to drop Gutsman on some people. Pretty sure. Is it Ice Ball M in Battle Network White? Oh no. I'm starting to think about it. Ice Ball M Mega Man Battle Network 3 White. Okay. It is. We're good. I'm not tripping. Good amount of Zenny, in all honesty, but no Ice Ball spawn yet. So, yeah, this is like the worst. Like, right now, I'm just preemptively doing stuff. Uh, at some point, it will be a requirement of me to come back here. So I'm just gonna do it now because, and literally after the next set of text, I'd be back here anyways. So yeah, here I am, crying, frothing up on the floor, wishing these things would spawn in. Actually a nice little trap they got themselves in here. Let's get the snakes. The snakes on a plane. What's up, boys? It's the goons. They're the goons. We should name them all. Huh? Is it here? I'm trying to remember off the top of my head. Cause I know, I know. Remember, I watched a speed run, and there was like a certain area someone was standing, but I don't think it matters where you stand. They can just spawn in. But I hope. I'm not wrong. Being honest with y'all. Pain. Everything sucks. Okay. Y'all are being hellaciously annoying. I wanted to move forward. I have movement bug. I hate movement bug. Guys, I'm annoyed. Guys, I'm hellaciously annoyed. Aha! Suck it, yo-yo! Bet you can't even walk the dog. Anyone here good at yo-yos? Had one as a kid, but those are all like the dollar store ones, you know? So. Come here. Come here, you big stupid fish shrimp. Making shrimp for dinner tonight, actually. I'm quite excited. Uh, give me a second. I'm going to pause until we kind of get to a good area here because we're kind of burning a lot of time. All right, hello, welcome back. This is different. I give up, I'll be honest with you, I give up. I have to go cook dinner soon. Um, I just don't have the time to just sit there and just spin in circles. Nothing was loading up. So now comes one of the most, yeah, Tora just breaks into my house. Um, 
So, Tora kind of explains here that he's traveling the world and really has no money. So, he just kind of tells Lan's mom that he's our friend, which, I mean, he is. Um, eats a lot of food, and then declares here that he's broke. Has no way of getting back home. So, in the next episode, we're going to have to... Well, okay, hold on. Let me cover some more base here. He also then says, I was at Chod's home, and he was, like, spying on him. So, he was telling him what Chod's secret is to being so strong. And now Lan's like, oh, I got to know. I want to be Chod. Well, turns out that Lan gets roped into doing a bunch of jobs for Tora so Tora could earn some money to, like, you know, get food, go home, do whatever he needs to do. So, yeah. Um, welcome to the monstrosity uh, that is the Tora scenario. So, Dex quickly calls us to the park, so I think it's a good idea to go over. <laughs> He's totally sucking up to our mom, dude. The absolute this man's totally into cougars. That's crazy. Alright, so Dex wanted to talk to us. I don't know why I'm saving, but here we are. So, something's kind of going on with Dex. So, yesterday at the hospital... Dex wound up leaving earlier, saying he wasn't, like, feeling all the best. And now Tora shows up here. And they kind of challenge each other in net battle. And they're very similar in personalities. They're very loud, boisterous, and dumb. Most importantly, dumb. And something's kind of being alluded here to Dex. They have uh, a battle. Dex winds up losing. But apparently it was really close. Everything's good. So Dex is hiding something from us. It's it's kind of obvious, but I'm not going to just kind of send it out right now. Um, then he kind of just leaves abruptly because Dex kind of gets the idea that Tora is his replacement right now. And that's how he's feeling. But there's more to it. And there's more to it, and we'll cover in the next episode. So thank you guys so much for tuning in again. I appreciate all you guys' support and comments and everything. So this episode was kind of... Meh. It was educational, I guess. Um, but hopefully we'll be able to get Ice Ball M and everything sorted out soon. I thought I could just knock it out quick because I did it in my own run. But of course, because I want to record and, you know, make this. Hey, look, uh, we're going to do this, guys. I'm going to show you guys. How no, no, no. It's not going to do that for us. It's going to make us suffer. So, yeah. So we're going to head down to the side lab in the next episode, get everything started. But thank you guys so much again. If you guys haven't already, make sure you guys do subscribe. Leave a like if you haven't already. My name is Moose. Thank you guys so much for the support. I love you all. And remember, we're always connected. Bye bye